Welcome back there, Armchair Warriors. Tom here with another episode, number 81 of XCOM 2 War of the Chosen. It's been a little while, thanks to the holidays. So we're picking up where we kind of left off here. Um, oh, we can bring a bond. Yes, yes, yes. All right, let's go ahead and do just that. Oh, wait. Before we do that... Oh, that's for... Never mind. So yeah, let's go ahead and improve the bond. It'll take a little bit of time, but we can afford to do that, I feel. Um, we also have... Do we need... I, th I feel we have somebody that's got negative traits somewhere along here, but we'll take care of that. So, wow, I've forgotten what we are doing here. Um, definitely need to get some alien alloys. Which I think that's what we're working on here anyway. we got a stack of stuff that's coming up here. Um, yeah, I mean, half of it is stuff that's in experimental. The uh, proving ground, so... Uh, neutralized target. Is that this one here? Infiltration mission expiring. Oh, we got a bunch of stuff that I need to take a look at here. Um, oh, this is what's expiring, but I don't care about this. Um, even though we got 19 people, yeah, I, I don't need another facility at this point right now. We can, we can ignore that. We don't need... Um, Rescue soldier. Yes, we're working on this already. Oh, wait, are we? The squad does not start with concealment. Detection ranges are increased by 3%. All right. Commander, you should be aware. We're detecting lost activity in this area. Our forces will need to be especially vigilant. That's fine. Um, th three mimic beacons might be a bit much, I feel. But that could be okay. Tech specialist, tech specialist, marine, and marksman. That's fine as well. Let's uh, see who else we can bring in on, on board to this mission here. Because we need to get this person back for sure. Um, a Reaper would be really good. But let's... Let's look at a... Well, no, I don't want to bring a separate. There's Lost involved. We don't need to be blowing stuff up left and right. Um, I got a couple of Marines I could throw in. You know, we got here. We also have a Reaper. That would be great. Um, both are captains. Let's take this one that doesn't have... Uh, maybe they'll get a bond with somebody here. Um, can you wear a better Reaper armor? Yes, powered Reaper armor. Vector rifle. We can swap that out for the Tempnotic. Let's do that one there. Instead of a pistol, yeah, let's stick with it pistol. You probably won't be using that that much, I feel. Um, greater crit? Yeah, let's let's keep that the way that is. So... We still have two Templars. Wow. Um, send an assault infantry to rescue an assault infantry. Uh, if I'm going to do that, let's just send a Templar in. Send someone that could stand to get some experience as well. Plated Templar. Zealot Tempest. I mean, the Tempest Gauntlets are where it's kind of at, I feel, because we do more damage with that. The stun chances, we get a 50-50, and I really want to play with that. Actually, this could be an opportunity to play with the Zealot Tempest Gauntlets just to see. It's going to do less damage, but a 50% chance to stun could be nice. Do the Mag Auto Pistol. We don't need that. We could use a Destroyer Vest. Yeah. I think that pretty much does it. Um, Advanced Suppressor would be good, because, yeah, we're fighting against Lost. Basic Scope, we can also do that as well. I think we are set. So yeah, this we don't really care about. I think that's what's expiring, because it, it's dropping off in three hours. Um, this is 24. I think we're working on the Rescue VIP. It's still, yeah, it's still going through. It's, um, oh, maybe not. Maybe 
maybe we are ready for that. Oh, you know what? We aren't going to be doing this because it's for a scientist. I mean, well, yes, we could use a scientist. I don't think I'm too concerned about that. Uh, recover item. This is what we're, we're going for over infiltration. Because, good God, there's a lot of stuff going on here. And that's the off-site avatar facility. We have a bunch of alien facilities we need to kind of churn through. Um, no, no. Let's keep going with this here. So, recover item from train. Yeah, we're going up to 100, we go up to 250. So currently at this point, we're gonna negate the restricted airspace and we're probably, one of these two is probably gonna negate the, uh, maybe the other one? Possibly not. That's the hunt. I doubt we can we can negate that. Our action together is complete, Commander. Spare parts for the reduced cost of all proving ground projects by additional thirty percent. So that's nice. Uh, they're tired, but they came back, so yay. So I mean, we've got plenty of people here to do stuff, but I don't think we need to. About. Do we have anything here? Scanning sites. We don't want to get the remains. We don't need useful items. Actually, soldier bonds are great. Um, if I still have like high, especially high-ranking people that aren't, you know, don't have a soldier bond, but we don't really need that right now. Um, okay. Wait, live fire training, GTS training. Oh, okay, that's for GTS training, which I haven't really been using either. So. Going with this here. Let's get this done. Sabotage transmitter. That's this one right here. Do we care about this? Counter dark Excel uh, event, Excel research, and Tism Carrions. We do. So there's a Muton Decarion, Arch, uh, Archon, Berserker, Muton Devastator, Spectre. So that's five of the 13. Um, probably see towers. Possibly. It, this may. This. It may just be a sit rep that's in here that's not going to really even affect us whatsoever. Uh, but there'll be there'll be lots of mutons around. Three steps, type touch transmitter. Yep, let's go ahead and do Setting it. course for the Arctic territories. Our mission of the day. We've got a counter counter that dark event. I, I know we've removed one or two dark events so far. So if we get to a point where we can get rid of all of them, that'd be great. Um, I got people with Kevlar armor, and they get pulled. So, Barksman, Templar, Sapper, Combat Engineer, Skirmisher, Assault Infantry. I got one of them, you know, everything pretty much. Um, we need to go to Predator armor instead of a sniper rifle. Exalt Goss rifle is 8 to 9 with a 2 3. So, that's on, on par with an anti material. That's nice. Um, instead of Hollow Targeter. That. We need plasma grenades for sure. Um, light on fire or this, yes, or squad site stuff, since you're a marksman. Um, and we need to give you something that's long range. Basic bipod. Plus five tiles, reducing rain, uh, blah blah, so that could work. Basic bipod on. Um, you are you are all set here. It looks like. Though so instead of a grenade, we have something else we could give you. I just realized I don't have any uh, mimic beacons. That could be kind of dangerous here. Um, I can't build any either. Don't have any alien alloys. That's moving. Plasma rifle, yes. So grenade, grenade, and what should we put in here? Set the target of flame. That means it's mutons we're pretty much fighting against. That would be useful against the lost. But that's alright. Um yeah, do that. So 
set stuff on fire. Com engineer, get you out of the Kevlar, but you predator armor. Instead of a cannon, you can use an Exalt Gauss Cannon 710. Yep, the Exalt Gauss Cannon is actually the best we have. The Mag Cannon's not a pushover. It actually does, uh, Mag Cannon does um, additional damage. I think it's got the extra clip size just because I would have got on there, but if I just do the Exalt, Exalt Gauss Cannon, that will do much better. Blaster Gauntlet, 6 to 8, that beats. Yeah, that's the best thing we got there. So the flamethrower range goes up one square per, so it's 8, 9, 10. Um, shred is 1, 2, 3. So, yeah, Blaster Gauntlet for more damage. Uh, plasma Grenade, sure. And let's give you a bonus to aim so you can actually hit with that pretty nice weapon. Uh, I'm not sure what that is there, but it's fine. Um, Skirmisher, is there something better than a grenade I could give you? Um, we don't have to, we just have Spectres, so we don't have to worry about that. I don't have anything else here. Let's give you a mana, nano mana kit just in case. And our salt infantry. Predator armor. Exalt scatter gun is 8 to 10. That's the best we have. And that one especially is the best instead of the sword, of course. Advanced blade. Though I really do like the, uh, the axe. Because you have that free, you can throw it. Sure, stick with the uh, with that. Um, all right, not the best equipped. Especially, I don't, like I said, I don't have mimic beacons at all. <laughs> three, three, three mimic beacons on one one group that's doing infantry, but they're also rescuing um, our assault and infantry. So, all right, what was our eleven? 11 enemies, and we identified five. Tons of mutons here, though, so it's lots and lots of armor. You have to remember, I am buzzing through cutscenes here. We don't need to stick on cutscenes. We've been picking up unusual readings coming from this area, and our recon team has confirmed that Advent is now operating some sort of massive psionic transmitter nearby. Shen and Tigan agree, if we destroy the transmitter while it's still connected to Advent's network, their operations across this entire region could be crippled. We're underground. Let's see what's going on here. Advent has constructed uh, a psionic yeah, transmitter chosen. in this area, tied directly into their primary network. Our intel suggests destroying it while it's still connected will severely damage their linked systems. 
Plant the explosives before they have a chance to pull the plug. Twelve remaining. That indicates to me that uh, we have chosen showing up here. There was only eleven. Um, so we have to plant the charges, neutralize all enemy targets, so we can kind of take this slow. Set here, just remember how everything works. Objective here. Our readings indicate that Relay is feeding energy directly into their network. If you can destroy it, it may disrupt their efforts to isolate the transmitter. Thanks, guys. I know all this stuff. <laughs> I've Getting done this type of mission so many times. Headed there now. We march toward enlightenment. Orders confirmed. Moving out. Um, I'm really hesitant to run him up so far like that. Um, though we could run up to here. That might be that might be sufficient. I know what to do, Commander. Kind of watch what's going on over the left side there. All right, so let's go enough for watch all. Eyes away, eyes. Get to cover. Mother. So the idea is I kind of want to get close enough to here to be able to do what, what it's asking, but when we spot the enemy, we can we can go loud and proud. Uh, we got two things here, we destroy those, that's going to give us two extra turns, so I'm getting on that. Moving there. Move, move, move. Not meeting anybody so far here. Got it, moving. Still not meeting. that far back either. There's not that much room between uh, the end of the map right here and, and our target, so... Um, doesn't look like we've got much... Yeah, we're not got much of a viewpoint on that, but we could open it up with uh, a, a judicious use of rocket. If we want to. So the main question is, do I... Yeah, let's go up and run my guy all over here. Double time. Not spotting anything, so so far so good. All right. Um, Get the cover. It's just you, and you're hunkering down. We're not hearing anything. For a dozen, well, eleven enemies out here in all Utahs. So I figure we hear some stompy stomp here pretty soon, but weird that we're not. I go as ordered. Moving to designated position. I'm on the move. Kind of splitting up a little bit. Oh, that's not going to be a good spot to go. Maybe it's going against here. So it is decided. But I think that's okay. Um, let's see here. That's going to be destroyed, so we don't need to be pressed up against that. We can go there. Will do. Be, yeah, 
So all eleven. There's got to be. That means there's got to be three groups. Uh, uh, group of four. Group of four. Or yeah, group of four. Group of four. Group of three. Um, and then the chosen will appear at, at their leisure when they get uh, revealed. But I'm thinking that Spectre might be floating around on its own. So there might be like two groups of three and a group of four, and then the Spectre. Path is clear. Let's get you here. Actually, let's get you here to look down this area here. That's affirmative. Oh wow, you've raised increased squad site. You still don't see anything? There's something seriously amiss here. Yep, let's do that. All right. Agreed, Commander. Watch I'm on it. Try to cover it. I'll maintain my watch. Yeah, we don't hear anything. Good God. So, hmm, hmm. you're staying up there for sure. Like I said, I could throw, I could run a bunker buster through, and and we could open up, we could open up some walls. So that's possibility. Um, we could run up here, open the doors, and maybe be able to run back. For sure, um, we're gonna take a, a shot when we can. Interesting. That's something I could do just to do. And you are definitely going to do something. You got, you got stuff you can just pop off big time. <sighs> Same with you. On the move. Let's see what happens. Holy cows. Well, we definitely can't move now, that's for sure. Um, <laughs> holy cows. A skyfall would have been just awesome right there. Yeah, where he's set up, he can't see anything. We'd have to move there, and that's not going to be too conducive. Okay, wow. All right, so we know they're all in there. <laughs> oh my goodness. Confirmed. Moving out. All right, all right, all right. Uh, we're going to meditate. Uh, we're going to relocate you to here. Designated coordinates. Do a brace. Um, we are going to put you on Overwatch just to get ready. Think the same for you. Watch. And the same for you. Scanning. Wow, that would have been the perfect opportunity with that door open to be able to like launch a rocket through it or something like that. Yeah, I jazzed back because I didn't know if they were going to come through the door. So, with that in mind, now. can't get there with, with him. Um, Order's confirmed. Let's see what happens when we pop the door open now. 
So they've all moved to the back or moved into here, further into here. Our sapper, there's not much you uh, you really do, is there? Yeah, I don't want to be here because when that grenade goes off, it's going to uh, kind of hurt. That's, that's a poster. It looked like that was a hole in the wall, this thing there. Um, we can run here. That's affirmative. All right, we're ready to go. Um, we are going to put everybody in Overwatch. Affirmative. Last turn for Overwatch. Oh, there we go. There we go. Yes, yeah, I mean. uh, here. So not sure what's going on there. Hmm. We don't see anything. Got that feeling. That's they a confirmed visual on the transmitter. Plant the X4 charges before they can cut it off from the network. Something and all the enemies back here. Wow. I mean, they could have. They could be back here too. Though at a certain point, we're going to be able to see them once they cross to this type of threshold. Um, well, let's dance back now. Let's just go Overwatch one more time. I'll keep it under rock. Get the cover. My eyes on. Yes, Commander. I take a new approach. Worth it. Worth it. So we will go back to hard As we here. All right. I mean, we got viewpoints of everything. Um, we can go one more turn. I'm like Affirmative. with eleven no, enemies wandering around, I'm pretty sure they're not behind me. I'm pretty sure on that. My goodness. I mean, at this point, we literally can stroll on in there, plant, and, and take care of that without, <laughs> without worrying too much. Um, coming in, so we're going to be doing this then. I run. Death Nail's the person best suited for this kind of thing. Okay. I give you strength. I'll give Death Nail uh, action.
The X-4 charges are active, but the aliens are still working to isolate the transmitter. Eliminate any remaining hostiles before they cut it off. I don't think they're upstairs at all, so we could probably, we could effectively just run up here, hide. And they can't, I haven't seen anybody take the stairs since I opened the door. Explosive action. There we go. Now get me back up to my point. <laughs> <Not so quickly. laughs> yep. Skirmishers are badass. Once you rank them up. All right, we're not gonna. Um, we're not gonna really do too much here. We're just going to. Well, let's go and overwatch with you just to make sure. Um, we can pull you back. Oh, that's right. You gave a you gave a turn. We can pull you back to here. I'm gone. You can go and overwatch as well. Oh, that was not what I meant to do. I thought I hit uh, three for Overwatch, but apparently that was three for Fire. Moving to Overwatch. Oh well, misclicks or misclicks. They are what they are. And we'll run him over here to... Knew the chest was going to show up. Warlock here in this case. You have been judged. I don't remember what the deal is with him. Attacks decrease the will of any soldier within sight. He can summon savage allies. Um, gains health when nearby enemies take damage. He takes increased damage from explosive explosions, and we have a skirmisher. And I am your punishment. Skirmisher's kind of on the other end. Depends what he's going to do here, which, oh good. He's run into there, which... Just as one of them I was on Overwatch, him running to there, I didn't, don't have you. The elders bless my hand in battle. <laughs> Prepare yourself, heretic! It's one of the Elders Chosen. It's one of the Chosen. This mission just got a little more dangerous. Stay on top of its position and try to take it out. that goes through armor, so it doesn't really matter overly much. Worst case scenario, I can always pull back further, let them come to me. Oh, there's the specter. Um, but I'd rather not fight that kind of rear guard action, because we'll have to move up and try to take on and engage the warlock anyway. So. Should be taking some uh, Overwatch shots. Or is he immune to that? I was going to say, he should be taking an Overwatch shot for sure since he got revealed. Oh, nice. Then there were 11. That's how it's done. Or then there were 12. Okay, so I guess there, there were 12 enemies to begin with. Um, First off. Well, quick burn. Uh, we could do Rouse, but I don't think that's necessary right here, right now. We could do that on the Berserker, set them on fire. I don't know. So that 
would set the uh, warlock on fire. Warlock or berserker? Oh, first things first. Can we throw a defensive mine down here? Where am I? Where's my guy hiding? Up there. So let's put it here so we don't destroy his cover. Now if the berserker comes through. It's not bad things. So we've, we've gotten that. So, yes, we've got the flamethrower we could do. What else can we potentially do here? Huh. Um, we can certainly do that, but I don't know much movement that we're going to be seeing here. We could do this. Throw a grenade, takes on the Miton Veles, and removes the uh, Spectre cover. So that actually might be a best... First mark there. Oh yeah, let's let's just go ahead and do that. All right. So we do have a skyfall we could potentially do. That's nice. Um, we don't have anything. So, uh, let's not shoot at those little things. We can take a shot on the specter, and it's a coin flip. It's actually better than a coin flip to kill it. Because we have a 70% chance to crit. If we crit, it's dead. And that might be a good, good first uh, thing. Yeah, let's do that then. Didn't crit. Like I said, I had a 50-50 shot of, of killing it outright. We're going to throw our axe. Let's take the easiest of the targets, I guess. Two Miton Decurions here, so let's just take at least one. Did some damage, that's good. Um, we could also, th can't throw a grenade, so we're going to end up firing, but we're not going to be able to do too much, so we may wait. We may have other opportunities. Um, a Whiplash. Rage the Berserker, which that could be fine. You can also integrate Grapple over to uh, <laughs> my buddy over there. Probably want to wait on this. Um, oh, Whiplash on the Warlock would do some nice damage, take him down to 23. 50% chance of that happening, though, so let's wait. Um, with you. I'm thinking a flamethrower on the warlock. Might be the better deal. I mean, obviously, we kind of. I mean, if I do have the Muton to carry it, good, a decent chance, uh, better than a percent chance of killing the Muton to carry it. The Berserker um, could would knock about half its health down, but the warlock, if, if we're going to be. Frank here, we, there's a lot of stuff we could be doing. So, set the Warlock on fire, blaster... Oh, you know what? Oh, uh, no, I have to do the um, I have to do the flamethrower first. Uh, flamethrower, and then bunker buster, I think on the bottom maybe, so that way it blows the floor out and the Warlock falls and takes damage. So. Firing incendiary! Freebie. Is on fire now. <laughs> we'll take zero to two damage over time and can't use most abilities. And some two alien turn starts. So can't use most abilities. What most abilities would be. I notice when you're on fire you really can't shoot, so there's that. Um, I don't have anything else free. I mean, I... Yeah, let's use the Bunker Buster now. So... This would be the most efficient, because it would be affecting four enemies in here. And that might even kill the Warlock. Let's pray it. It's where I put it. Yep. some damage. 
damage there. Yay. Alright, we still got you. Shock can do some pretty heinous stuff here. We're waiting on you, because we got stuff that we can potentially do. Uh, whiplash. 100 on the Berserker. We could kill 100 on the Warlock. We will kill the Warlock. trace of that chosen left <laughs> i've got a feeling we haven't seen the last of them Still i don't think you get it well there might be an achievement you get for today. killing a chosen the right right turn it appears um but i think i've already earned that if that is such a case um so i only have one action period i mean i could do an integrated grapple and go to there but that's that's not going to afford me anything at all we can fire um actually what does firing look like so, a little bit of damage on uh, Bill's Heat, a little bit of damage on the Berserker. You've done as well. Archon, I could kill 84%. And that might be the that might be the play to do. Okay. So we got possibilities here with him. So Skyfall. If I uh, empower this, so if I empower this Skyfall on the Archon, we will kill it for sure. Um, we would affect the Muton to Kurgan. I still got the Spectre I need to take out. So I'm looking. If I'm going to drop, I'm going to drop on the Archon. It's sad that the, the Berserker is too far away. Let's go ahead and Skyfall on, well, let's actually wait. Let's make sure I don't have any grenades I can throw or anything like that. Uh, because I do... Alrighty. I need to kill that Spectre, which might require me... Oh, so these are my only three guys I've left. I can't get a grenade in there. Um... Slash the Spectre, but that's not gonna, gonna want to do that. So I can move up here, take a shot on the uh, Spectre. A miss will still kill it. Let's get into hard cover there. I'm like this. Well, you better like it. <laughs> Let's take the shot. Ten. All right. So we still got. I mean, I still got a slash with the, with my guy here, which <sighs> yeah, I don't want to go hand hand the berserker because that's foolish. Um, so we're doing a skyfall on the archon, which will also freeze the decurion. So it disoriented the Decurion there. Okay. So we can get out of here, but there's really not too far we can go. Best bet is just to sit and parry. Um, so that being the case, then, what does shooting look like? 100 on the Berserker. The low odds on the Decurion. Um, but if I go Wrath, what does that look like? 
kill the mute on Decurion, which is di which is disoriented. So honestly, probably not that big of a deal. My concern is though, it'll well if I go parry and if it's going to fire and miss, the parry's not not wasted. And parry only affects shots that would hit. So I have no chance of critting on the berserker, and I really don't want to enrage it at this point. Um, advantage of the Wrath is I get to go many more different places. Um, Ripjack Strike is within my range. So, do I do that or just simply fire? 100% of the Berserker, that'll enrage it a bit. There's absolutely no crit chance on it whatsoever. Crit chance there. No crit chance. And I mean, uh, better than a flip, a coin flip, but too low of odds, I feel. I kind of feel I need to take the, go ahead and just take the shot at Berserker. It's going to piss him off, but I can finish it up next turn. Yeah, it's in rage now. So, uh, we are going to parry. And pray he can soak up some damage. He's disoriented, so he'll probably miss. So there's the Berserker's probably gonna go attack on shock. Yeah, I wish there was something I could do. Uh, some place I could go that would be somewhat safe. I know, let's parry. comes in effect, so yay at that, I suppose. The elders pursue me. I don't know how he deflected that shot. I thought it was only one shot he gets to deflect. That was it. He's deflecting everything. I'm under huh. fire. I don't think I can defend this. Yeah, I was going to say. That's like an area effect. Oh, he's suppressing me. No, no, I hate those things. I do too. They're flanking my position. Yeah, they certainly did. That was a lot of damage. Ouch. There's still the one more. Oh, I could be losing somebody here. <sighs> well. Not much I can do about that, I guess. So, Wrath on the Muton. Carry in here, or was it like that? Kind of poor to shoot. So let's wait, because we may have some options here. Does not look like it though. Yeah, we only have one shot we can take. That that's it. So what does can we get a concussion rocket? Devil Dog's got to get out of here. Let's peel back to some cover. What's over there? Wait. Um, this being so I can't. 
can't get out of there at all. I can do it in power. I don't know. I mean, I can also do a brand for an action, but... I really don't want to go hand-in-hand -hand with mutons, because they can, they can parry. They can parry your attack, so I need to get him out of here. Yes. So I could throw a grenade here, move this cover, force him out. chance of shooting, even up top here, is like, wow. You cannot run! Changing position. Kill the Berserker. Which I feel is probably the best shot of all here. And now we can grapple our way. That's the only place we can go up to. Is be a height advantage for one, so that'd be cool. I can actually go back to there. Get back to some sort of cover. Cool. Okay. Concussion rocket. It doesn't look like I can get to that guy. Concussion rocket. Oh, there we go. I need to get rid of that. Suppressive fire there. Orient him as well, so that's good. Cool, cool, cool. So we can indeed kill him. Could kill him for sure, too. He's the only one that can do anything at this point. So I might as well kill. You will pay the price. I failed my effort. He actually stayed up. I don't understand that. Yeah, hand-to-hand 
it's not going to be very effective at this point. Not dead. <laughs> Bring it right into my other bomb. Need help. about the only thing that he's able to do here. Um, nothing, it seems like. I'm going to have to drop him down to there, I feel, but let's see. See if we can't kill that guy now. <laughs> Kidding me. No can do. <sighs> can use the extra guns. Let's do a rupture. We're gonna do anything. A rupture would be best. Light him up. Oh wow. Okay, so I got one. Yes, you did. And I killed him. I think there's only four left now. One's gonna die here next turn. Yeah, it's everybody on this side now. Go closer. so long. I had to keep on reloading. I just kept on getting in a situation where I was losing two or three people at a time, getting very frustrated, so I kind of took a little bit of a break and stepped away, came back, and had a fairly flawless mission. Basically what happened, uh, I had to pull everybody back uh, once once I took care of the uh, the chosen same method I did before, right? Let them on fire with the, flame, with the free flamethrower shot, uh, bunker bomb, knocked them, uh, had them fall down, and uh, my skirmisher used his uh, freebie uh, Electro Whip to, to finish him off. And then, instead of <laughs> jumping my uh, my Templar into the midst of all the enemies with uh, with a Skyfall, all I ended up doing was just kind of falling back a little bit and then picking him off one by one, throwing grenades and stuff like that, just just whittling whittling, whittling them down. Um, I actually had a, a lucky uh, the Berserker chased me into the uh, the uh, grenade trap I had set for set for them on the right side underneath my uh, skirmisher and uh, it blew itself up it actually got a crit and blew itself up so that was like super lucky there but that just kept on falling back to uh, to the hard point positions that we were able to we were able to move back to just going overwatch and 
and just whittle them down as they came in on us. Um, a marksman had a, had a um, another excellent crit, um, I think around 16, 15 points of damage on uh, on a muton, killing it in one shot, which was amazing. So, apologize for not there for all of it, but like I said, I just got a little bit frustrated in with what was going on. I'm at the point of the game where, yes, frustration levels are pretty high. I hate losing. Um, these high-ranking individuals that I've got. That's like it's like too difficult to deal with. Uh, we have another bond we can improve, but I think we're already yeah we're already working on somebody right now. So with that said, we completed the objective, got the uh, the counter to the dark event going there. So going forward here, we're pretty much I think I'll spend a little time here on the. Uh, I know the video is probably about an hour long at this point here. Let's spend a little bit more time in getting. The uh, uh, not what I wanted to do. And getting the uh, well, so laggy all of a sudden. I want to get this taken care of. We have a new mission here: destroy alien relay, counter another dark event, exile research genetic combat chips. We probably will do that. Andromedon, uh, elite purifier, elite shield bearer, elite trooper, muton. So that's five out of eleven. Um, not too bad. It's got four days. We'll actually wait. Let's do this Where's for a little bit. Where's your confidence grown? Do you feel a sense of credence in your tactics growing among the soldiers? Good. Let them taste arrogance. So mean. But yeah, we need to work on this. Our forces were ambushed. But all will survive this troubled action. Uh, Venator, Bug, Muton, David Shieldbearer, Better Purifier. This defeat will be a costly one. This will indeed be. I'm going to go and pause it while it's loading up here so we're not spending time spinning around doing nothing. Alrighty. So it looks fairly straightforward here. We got a. The uh, point there. I don't know who the heck I even has. So I got a field medic. Tech specialist. Field medic and marine. Okay. I also would just rather wait up top here because there's reinforcements that are going to come in. So we do have a mimic beacon, that's good. Yep. As I thought, reinforcements. Great one, your team is compromised. We're picking up advent response forces inbound on your position. Whatever you say. No hay problema. Let's see how this goes. Let's see what's getting dropped. Two enemies. Trooper and officer. Oh, general, the general. That's what we needed first. <laughs> there you go. Pistol, nice. Which I don't know if I get to keep after this because we're just running out of here. So I mean, this could be a uh, that, that could be a drop that we don't ever get to see. Um. Okay, so we can actually come down to here. Is it clear? Yeah, it's clear. And just frag it from behind. Yep. Okay, so I got one. Alrighty. So 
We're not going to spend, I don't think we'll spend the whole entire video on this, but let me see how far I can get here. Claro que sí. Oh, we got that there, which I don't, I don't want to deal with. I think I want to run through this building, in all honesty, here. So let's stack up on it. We're not going to open. Now we shall open the door. No problem, boss. You to detect an angle, that's kind of a bummer, but whatever. So let's see what we can do here. Everybody's got uh I hope it's worth it. Target. There we go. Seems doable. <coughs> no, I can't see the guy unless I'm like around right on top of him, I guess, so. Let's just go here. Wow. Okay. Scanning. Uh, uh, <laughs> well, good start there. Unfortunately, he's probably going to teleport in the midst of my guys here or something like that, so we'll see. Explosive radius, but I mean, we gotta we gotta take it out, obviously. Yeah, took damage. Fortunately, we have get up and get medic with us, so yay. Our tech specialist see in regards to. No hay problema. Let's run up here. Oh, do we not get this? Okay, fine. En marcha. Scanning. Affirmative. Covering now. Well, let's see what these two things give here. Hypnography, hypnography. Um, I mean, basically, the other one's 100% hypnography, so if I'm going to go with that, I'll just use the other one. This one's got a higher override chance, which I'm not sure what that's for. So, reduce enemy will by 50%. Soldier gains complete immunity from the next two attacks. Um, that's a 46% chance, being 56 once I uh, do the freebie. Main filtro por el punto de acceso. Throw in the freebie uh, fail safe. Um, if that works. Oh, what was the penalty? 
Ouch. I might just do the hypnography and just lower their will by 100% and just be done with it. Or 50% rather, and just be done with it. Yeah, group enemy reinforcement. So, we're just going to do the hypnography. Would have gotten a variety on the other one with it being uh, boosted, but. Reduce enemy will by 50%. Tent means that they'll tend to run away, panic, you know, that kind of stuff. So, yay. Not a big deal, honestly, but. I not see it when I was in there earlier. Okay. Take the low odd stun chance, and that doesn't work, then throw the mi up. mimic beacon. to it, that way I'm like in its face. Yeah. I've got a freebie a freebie reload that I can take. Um so yeah let's run in right to right in its Don't face here. My time. And we'll just use the point blank shotgun again. slow to the exit point here, but, I mean, running into an enemy here, enemy there, yeah. Only six remaining, though, so... Um, let's go through a round of reloads here. We'll do normal reloads. Locked and loaded. Uh, we can actually move up with you to here. Desde luego. Right, I can actually even move my, uh, guy up. And the shield bearer. But we got some more watches. Missed. We've got Advent here. I say it was a coin flip, but yay, we won. That all you got? We won on that. Um, so we do have a rocket. No hay problema. With five enemies left, though, what happens if we do a combat protocol? That would be some good damage, actually. Rocket, we couldn't even do so. Yeah, let's do combat protocol. <laughs> and I guess 
purifiers get that response time, response ability. That fortress gets hardcover, so yay. Um, it might be best just to go full on, because it will kill it. There we go. Big deal. Four remaining. Here comes another muton. Ugh. But hey, at least we're, you know, where we're at, two mutons actually. We're in a good position where we're at, so if we can maintain that just pick these guys off one by one. Then it is good. So he will not have ability to fire, so if I run up there, that'd be, that'd be okay. Um, I do have the rocket launcher still, which I thought I had an ability to there Let's go ahead and get this taken care of and knock the uh, wall uh, down. Oh, um, let's just kill him then. <laughs> wow. So wherever he runs to, he will have hard. Uh, if I can run him to hard cover, he will go on Overwatch automatically. If I remember correctly, right? Yeah, ever, ever vigilant. So if I run up to here, or to the rock, actually be better. Location confirmed. <sighs> Hold on one second here. Fixed it, moved him, moved him where he was going to be, which of course procked the uh, muton, but that's okay. Is it clear? Three enemies, and I got two mimic beacons left. I th think we could probably stand to. Uh, Take care of that here. On Overwatch. There we go. Run Overwatch. Now I should fire at the mimic beacon. Nope, oh, he was actually firing at me, so he didn't fire. do anything. Bummer. So let's start things off with this guy here. Kind of probably mess, but let's see. What happens. Let's go ahead and do a suppression. Stay put. We all have new beacons, so I mean, I can. I can lay down another one here. I was just blind him as well too, so that way he can't do much. Save the mimic beacons for when I run into multiple enemies. And I hope it's here. worth it. Got it covered. Yeah, complete miss. Complete whiff. I'm pinned down here. With that dark orientation. really so he could I could give it to Tapper. <coughs> Do I not have I don't have the ability to chew chew up his uh now it's up to eighty four percent so that's good. Um chew up his uh, cover. Running dry that's fine. We shall go we should now do the free reload. Ready to go. Good time to do it. Then we'll go on Overwatch. Overwatch. That must be a glitch because it's not showing that it reloaded. Ajustando tiro. Voice 
Biblioteca de munición. Overwatch. Let's go and kill him then. Oh wow. Yeah, I didn't get it. See, that must have Weapons glitched out because I had a free reload. I didn't, I spent the free reload and didn't reload. <laughs> All right, let's run up a bit. Yeah, boy. Uh, what does it look like when I shoot? 49, it's a coin flip. Um, let's see what happens. Nada. Necesito so, let's go ahead and give him give an extra strength. turn. And now, let's throw the mech beacon down here, right in front. Over there. Yeah, we gotta we gotta start moving up a bit more. <laughs> Just in sight. My ammo's running low. Wow, he's actually gotten down. Coin flips missing here. 50% chance, 50% chance, 50% chance. So let's go ahead and suppress it. I need to get to a better position so I can heal. Let's All right, I'll go. You'll be fine. <sighs> so, okay, so he's got some cover there, I see. So let's run up here. Let's screw it. Three guys, three enemies left, I think. Two, two enemies left, okay. That's doable. I'm going. Let's reload. Oh yeah. Let's reload. Ya podemos let's, reload. let's do this. Uh that's kinda of dangerous to run up there. I should just run up to there. Let's get so we'll this go show on the road. automatically, and I will just have him go and overwatch. Alright, cool, cool. So far, so good. Shouldn't have anything over there to speak of. Maybe... It's a human for a second there. I thought, oh my god, it's a sectoid. <laughs> How did I miss the sectoid? Is it clear? Rolling out! <laughs> claro que sí. Explorando. Badlands should go in Overwatch because all they did was they move there. Got it covered. Yeah, there we go. Never mentioned. All right, I'll go. Well, we're gonna spot something here. Or something's gonna spot us, I should say. 
Maybe because of, actually, maybe because of the, yeah, that guy yelling. Uh, let's see. Whatever you say. No hay problema. Affirmativo. Cubriendo. Get some. Enemies on the move. Not gonna move black magic just yet. We'll move you though. Don't have any hard cover that can get behind, unfortunately. Actually, there. That'll no work. need to ask twice. Yeah, boy. Should be proccing something momentarily then. No, no. Again, it's just the guy yelling. Um, which may be inside the building, so that could be interesting. What's over there? In Guardia. On Overwatch. Affirmative. Covering now. Mentioned Overwatch. I love that ability. Very, very handy. So, move our back cannon guy up. To there. And apparently there's somebody inside the building, because we can see switch. Mute on, mute on. Okay. Deal. Still have a mimic beacon remaining. Any shot on the muton that connects will kill it now. Scanning. I prefer the closer one to move and be fired at them, but that's okay. This works. position here. Um, obviously I need to get him to a better position as well too. Um, first off though, is that not a gas tank? Let's move him up closer. Oh, yeah, boy. This will kill the muton. civilians <laughs> that were in the area. Wow. Um, we may not have to do anything. Move up to here. Don't slow me down. Point blank should take care of it. Yep. You're just lucky they don't let me use my hands. Easy now, soldier. There we go. And that's it of the enemies, too, so yay on that. I'm going. Yeah, no enemies at all, so we can just march right on up the road on here. Bien. Yeah, longer video than I anticipated. I didn't know how long this was going to take, so I was thinking maybe I might just, you know, kind of take a look and see what, what what's happening what's in this there? mission to uh, extract my team, and maybe save halfway Boy. through or something like that, but yeah, this came out okay. 
the Venator with only three guys actually is not, not as bad. <laughs> because when it explodes, when it explodes, it's typically not going to be affecting my uh, my got too many of my guys. A Venator out in the open is not as bad either as a Venator down in the sewers. Ugh, close combat stuff is just deadly. Well, I appreciate you guys hanging with me on this here. Let's take a uh, mission photo. Oh. Oh well. <laughs> we shan't take a mission photo then. Uh, but anyway, let me go ahead and pause it while we're waiting. Alrighty, let's get some promotions. Wounded, but that's all right. Uh, this is our field medic. We are on this top part here. Anti venom, maybe. Uh, partially as much as full, yes. We're doing that regardless. Grave of the wounded, eight days. Wounded three. It's not too bad actually. Uh, our tech specialist. Turn so I can shoot twice or shoot or yeah, shoot twice or turn or shoot, do something else. Uh, repair chance to panic targets. I'm thinking that uh, lowering the enemy's will did not help at all. <laughs> I should have, I don't know, don't know what I should have done, but yeah, it is what it is. <laughs> Brain. That was for the Venator. So we didn't get the golden gun after all, and the one thing stock that dropped as well, too. That's why I kind of figured. We are victorious, and the cause uh, okay, additional down. resistance orders and covert actions. We gained some additional intel on the Chosen as a result of our latest cool, action. Cool. We are bound by a common enemy. Uh, and new faction orders granted sabotage. All skirmishers. We have one block all after our progress at the end of every month. Bonds are eager to hear your orders, that Brandon. is kick-ass. We're going to save at this point. Here. We're gonna, again, thank you guys for sticking with me here and watching this. It was a painful episode, I'll admit, because of the last uh, the mission prior to this one. But nonetheless, we are getting through this. My goal is, to, my, my hope is, uh, to try to finish this up in about 120, 130 episodes. Um, and then move on to something else, either maybe something totally different. Uh, the uh, the Aliens uh, XCOM game that I've got. I forget the name of it right now, but uh, let's see here. What's it called? Aliens Dark Descent. That's what I have. It's, it's kind of like a XCOM type. We also have uh, XCOM uh, Chimera Squad uh, we could go into, which is the sequel to this particular game here. So there's, there's options there. In any event, thank you guys so much for watching. I will see you next time. Bye.